Hello class, this is my phonemic awareness instructional activity and we're going to start off with blending techniques and this is going to be sound by sound blending and this is going to be a sound blend and then we're going to complete and the word is not going to be complete, we're going to sound it out together and the word is man, ma, and Put it together, man, very good. And then we're gonna move on to the next one, him, huh, eh, m, very good. Put it together, him, and this is gonna be like a scoop. We're gonna scoop through it, and it's gonna be, the word is chat, ch, a, very good. Now we're going to move on to our next blending. And this is continuous blending. And this one, it's going to be a sound loop to the next. So we're going to do man, m, an. That's right, I'm looping. The next word, pen, p, in. And you're going to hold it until I move on to the next one. Very nice class. Okay, now we have whole word blending. And what this is, is we are just going to say the one sound that we're ready for. Uh, I'm going to point to it, and that's the sound that we're going to say. And then we'll do the next sound. We're not going to put it together yet. And the word is crab. So it's going to be cra. Eh, bah. This is a little harder. Crab. Put it together. Crab. Very good. The next word. Coil. K. Oil. L. Put it together. K. Oil. Very nice. And we're gonna move over to the next one. And it's click. Cl. Try it again. Put it together. Cl I -k. Put it together. Click. Very nice. Now we're going to move to a decoding technique. It's kind of like a flip book, except I did it on a single page. And we're going to start off with Ben. B N. Well, we're going to change the beginnings of this word. And we're going to make it in. That's right. Or what about f in? That's right. We can change any of those out. Now we could change out the second portion of this word and we can make that at. Or what if we did b at? What if we changed this one out and it became b? Un. That's right. Very nicely done. All right. Now, we just learned about our Elkin boxes, and this is one of my favorites. But um, we are going to start with our cat. Got our cat picture here. We've got our sounds here. And we can go ka at the word cat. We can also reverse that, and it could be Duh. Ah. Duh. Put it together. Dog. Very nice. And now we're going to move on to this is our phonemic deletion. And we're going to use light boxes. And what we're going to do on this particular one is I've got it. Very nice. Now, what if I decided to change the I to a at? At. That's right. It to at. So, what we did was we deleted the A. Now, we've got a third box, and we're going to do ship. 
brush in. Sorry. Yep. And now we're going to turn off the P. Okay. So we're going to turn the P off. And what does that, what do we have? We have a sh in. That's right. Now what we're going to do is we're going to do another one. We're going to go bath. B. A. Eh. That's right. What if we turn off the B? We're going to delete here, and it's going to turn that off, and what we've got is F. That's right. Very nicely done. Very nice. Okay, and now we're going to move on to manipulation. And what I've got here is I've got boxes, and this can be done with stickies. It can be done pretty much with... Um, um, with coins with the letters on them, but we have s at. So what if we decided to change the s out and we make it k at. So we changed out the s to a k. Very nice. So what if we decided to change out the t for a p? Think we can do this? K -a -p cap. Very nice. And um, this is just a sample of some of our lessons for phonemic awareness instruction. I hope you enjoyed my video.